Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Kayla here from Pumps and Pouts. Today I am going to be working with some fabulous products by a very fabulous brand called Found. Found Beauty is a really cool um, skincare, makeup line, beauty brand. Um, you can find them at Walmart um, and all their products have like natural ingredients in them. Um, I was sent a few things maybe I can't remember. I want to say it was earlier this year. No, earlier last year. Not earlier, but like mid last year sometime. Maybe over the summertime. Um, so I was introduced to the brand then. So they sent me out a few products. Um, really enjoyed them. Especially their skincare is amazing. I've seen and been watching their makeup line. Um, I definitely want to try a few more things. I was able to grab their foundation from Walmart. Um, they're actually... I, I tell you, I went to a couple Walmarts already and like most of the time they're sold out of a lot of the products, which is a good thing. That means they're selling and that's great. They've been sending me really cool products. Like this time they sent me this California Poppy Lotion here. Um, they also sent me some setting spray, a lot of serums or face oils. Um, they also sent me this time this white clay toning spray so that was really cool they also sent me out some eucalyptus uh, eucalyptus detoxifying face wipes so i will get to try that later when i go and take all this off they've also sent me out some eyeshadow palettes i will be using this one this time i have another video that i have yet to post yet but i used this one actually you've guys seen a little sneak peek of it um on instagram if you guys follow me pumps and pals um i did use this palette in my first one with that and then they've also sent me out a few blushes so they've sent a good bit of things um their mask actually their mascara is probably one of my favorite things um it has a great brush on there. It's volumizing, gives you big, poofy, beautiful lashes. So I do love that a lot. But other than that, the brand's awesome. Um, just to give you like some little more details about the brand. I Miracle ingredients from cultures of the world known for their healing properties are combined with potent plant actives to create modern personal care solutions that never sacrifice quality, um, which is really awesome. I do love that they use a lot of natural ingredients in their products, um, which is really cool that actually a lot of the bottles or packaging will tell you how much um, natural ingredient is in it. It says this one is 97% um, natural. This is their California Poppy Lotion. Um, I'll go into more detail with some of these later, but I love that they do have that on the outside of it. Super cool brand. So stay tuned and hope you enjoy this natural little look by a natural ingredient brand. <laughs> All right, so. I actually just washed my face with this Found Firming Hibiscus Cream Cleanser. So now after I have cleansed my face, I am going to take this Found Pore Care White Clay Toning Spray and I am going to spray that all over my face. So it says this will help tighten pores and balance excess um, sebum. So now that I have my toning spray on, I'm going to now apply this Marshmallow Calming Face Serum. And this is 97% and also tells you that it's um, for sensitive skin, which is great for me. Um, it's ancient ritual says, dating back to ancient Egypt, Marshmallow is known to provide temporary relief for skin irritation. So that's going to help me a lot because I talk about how really sensitive my skin is and it gets pretty irritate it easily. So now I'm going to apply this a couple drops in my hand and apply it to my face. And last before I start my makeup, I'm going to put on um, California Poppy Face Lotion here. And this says it calms sensitive skin and soothes visible redness. And it is also 97% natural. Right, 
So now that my canvas is ready to go, I can go ahead and start the makeup process. And so I'm going to actually use their um, smoothing face primer, which I kind of showed you guys this um, in my last video. Um, and it blurs the looks of, it blurs the look of fine lines and pores. And it's made with bilberry and peach fruit abstract. Um, it's 90% natural. So we are going to go ahead and apply this to our face now. So the other day I actually went out and, um, because I didn't have a foundation, of theirs and I really wanted to kind of you know do a full look but even though I am kind of missing a few items to do an entire full look I think in the future I will once I grab some more of the items but I was able to pick up the foundation um, this is their nourishing liquid foundation here and I was happy they at least had my shade um, so we are going to apply that all over Okay, so um, not bad. It gives pretty good coverage and it also actually matches, which is great. So I'm liking this foundation for sure. Okay, so now for my eyebrows, um, I don't have, well, actually I do have a brow pencil. They sent me their Found Shape and Define brow pencil, um, brow pencil, but it's, it's too light. It's in taupe and my brows are like black. so. Um, I can't use that one and I actually was thinking about getting in but I couldn't re remember if they sent me a dark brown or which shade they sent me. So I'm just going to use this uh, Maybelline Brow Precise Micro Pen um, pencil here. Okay, so now I'm going to put on some eyeshadow primer so I can get ready to do my eye makeup. I'm just using, this is um, Wet n Wild eyeshadow primer that I um, grabbed from out of Walmart. So now for my eye makeup, I'm going to be using this Found eyeshadow palette. Um, they sent me actually a couple. They sent me, this one is 20, 20 blush, and this is t the um, 10 nude one. So I'm going to use the nude one this time. I'm going to start off with wheat, and I'm going to add that into um, my brow. And then I'm going to take sable. And I'm going to kind of go all over my lid and into my crease. Now I'm going to take Espresso and go into the outer corners of my crease. And then a little bit into my crease as well. Now I'm going to take copper and go back um, into the center of my lid. Now I'm going to take seashell and go into the inner corners of my eye. Next 
next I'm going to be putting on mascara and I'm going to be using the Found Volumizing Mascara here. So I didn't, I wasn't able to get the um, concealer and uh, their contour kit didn't, it was unfortunately not dark enough. Um, but I have this NYX uh, Sculpt and Highlight here um, that I will be using for a highlighter and for a contour color. Oh, this is a lot orange. More orange than I thought it was, actually. I'm not going to use a lot. To set my um, concealer, I am going to just use this e.l.f. under eye um, setting powder and um, just apply a little bit underneath my eyes. Okay, so now moving on to blush color. So I have two different blush colors. I have this baked illuminating blush and then I also have a nourishing cream blush tint. Um, trying to figure out which one I want to use. This baked blush is kind of more of a like a softer bubble gum. Well, not bubble gum, more like a I don't know, it's like a light pink. I don't know how to explain it. But this one's kind of a little more of a lighter um, pink shade. That's one not, that one's not a bad shade. Or I can do this cream one here, which looks to me that it's like, oh no, it does show up pretty good. I was wondering how that would work. And that one's a little darker, but not by much. Hmm. <laughs> I'm thinking that I actually use my cream tint as a lip color and then I can use this as a regular blush color. That's what I think I am going to do. Swipe this onto our cheeks. Alright, so blush is now on. Um, for my highlighter, I'm actually going to use these Radiant Illuminating Drops that they sent me. And I'm going to just apply it like a highlighter. So I think this, which is really cool, you can kind of mix it in with your foundation. You can put it on underneath your foundation. Or you can use it like as a highlighter to um, give yourself a pretty glow as well. Dab it onto the highest point of my cheekbones to give myself a little glow. And it just gives you a good subtle glow, nothing like too crazy. So now that I've done highlighting, 
I'm going to go ahead and set everything and I'm going to be using their Dewy Makeup Spray. So I said I was going to use that cream foundation, I mean cream um, blush as my lip color. I'm going to take this uh, NYX liner, lip liner, and this is in chestnut. No, net, nutmeg, sorry. And I'm going to take that blush, the Nourishing Cream Blush Tint, and this one's in Petal Flush, and I'm going to use that actually as a lip color for today. All right, and that will complete my look here. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I surely enjoyed making it. Um, I also absolutely enjoyed the found products that I found on my own and also that I was sent out. Found's a really great brand. I love the fact that they use natural ingredients within it. Um, so yeah, if you like this look and you like the products that I use, give me a thumbs up. Or if you really loved everything and love all my videos that I've been pushing out lately, please subscribe to my channel. You can find me on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, and Facebook at Pumps and Pounds. <laughs> Until next time, guys, I will see you later.